Thank you. <laughs> Tonight, the voices of a people who have been overlooked in the traditional history books. We shall fragment the South into a thousand pieces and put them together into an image of democracy. I've lost a great deal by this man and that man and the other man and the great men are going to get all we have and I think it's time for us to rise and put a stop to it. We didn't want to hear the words of the people in the White House. We wanted to hear the words of people who were picketing the White House. Agitators, the anti-war protesters, the socialists and anarchists. In other words, the people who gave us whatever liberty and democracy we have in this country. I know the truth, and you don't, you fools! You fools! What's common to all of them is the spirit of resistance to illegitimate authority. Democracy is in dissent. Democracy is in resistance. Democracy doesn't come from the top, it comes from the bottom. Young people are detached from history, the planet, and most important, the future. You tell me what the noble cause is that my son died for. And if he even starts to say freedom and democracy, I'm going to say bullshit. You tell me the truth. You tell me that my son died for oil. You tell me that my son died to make your friends rich. Mother, mother, there's too many of you crying. He says women can't have as much rights as men because Christ wasn't a woman. Well, where did your Christ come from? He came from God and a woman. Man didn't have nothing to do with it. Come on. What we got to say, power to the people, no delay, to make everybody see in order to fight the powers that be. Let me hear you say, fight the power. Fight the power. We're the only country in the world that's been fighting a war since 1940. Count the wars. Korea, Vietnam, count the years. If I thought the war was going to bring freedom and equality to 22 million of my people, they wouldn't have to draft me. I'd join tomorrow. We see these voices as patriotic voices, patriotic in the best sense of the term, in that patriotism is not obedience to government. Patriotism is obedience to the principles for which government is supposed to stand. You want to talk right down to earth in a language that everybody here can easily understand.